Hello my loves, what's good? It's your girl Victoria Jane and today we went for a, a glam gore kind of look. I'm going to be using the new Anastasia Sultry palette and her glitter and this is what we came up with. So I hope you'll enjoy. Okay so I'm going to zoom y'all in just a little bit just so you can see. Okay. Cool. So I'll go in with the NYX Micro Brow Pencil in the shade Brunettes. Um, we're going to go in. Oh, damn, she dirty as hell. And we're going to go in with the Gerard Cosmetics Brow Bar to go in medium to ebony. First, I'm just going to brush my little hairs up because they're looking a little nasty. And all I'm going to do is start with the front and just get those hair strokes in legit this pencil is like perfect for that so i'm only gonna do this in the front area like look at that difference already bitch you kidding me now what i'm gonna do is just line the rest of my eyebrow i always find products that i used to use and i used to be like my go-to i find and i'm like the fuck why, why did i stop using this like so and now what I'm going to do is go in with that brow bar to go. I'm going to use the middle shade right here. I'm going to keep it not to the front, but almost like a few... What's the word? Fuck knows. Basically, I'm not going to put it all the way to the front. You, 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 you see where I'm putting it. Now I'm going to go in my concealer, which is from Collection in the shade Zero. And I'm just going to shape that full brow. And then get on to the next one. So let me quickly do that. Legit, all my brushes are in front of me cleaned from yesterday in. <laughs> oh my god, it's a mess. It's a mess. Okay, I'm going to go in with my Beauty Combined brush. This is just a flat brush. And we're going to put all that product on that brush like so. And start outlining. And then I'm just going to cover my whole lid in this as well. Yeah, she looking cute though. Now we got a clean, crisp brow. Now I'm gonna do the other one off camera and then get straight back to y'all to do the eyeshadow. Okay, both brows on. We got our slugs back. Now we're gonna jump into the eyeshadow. We'd use the beautiful Sultry palettes. I mean, of course I had to fucking use it. So let's get straight into her. So we're going to go straight in with just a fluffy packing brush from Morphe. So first shade I'm going to start off with is... I was going to start off with Dystopian? Dystopian? If I can't say these names, don't come for me. I'm, I'm got a fun clue. Anyways, we're going to start off with Twig, which is like this quite neutral, light brown nude shade. And I'm actually going to go in with... What am I going to go in with? Let's go in with my Bow Beauty Angled Blending Brush. It, oh, damn. Damn! Okay, pigmen. Jeez. Okay. So like I always do, I like to pack on the product first and then go back in with another brush and blend it all out. Now I'm going to go in with... What am I going to go in with? My Bow Beauty Tapered Blending Brush. Blended like a dream. Yo, I've legit forgot to get like a little towel thing, flannel, whatever you want to call it, through to like wipe my residue off product. So I'm using my trousers. I'm a nasty ass bitch. Okay, okay. So now I'm going to go straight into, let's just say dystopian, dy dystopian? Fuck knows. We're going to go into these these we're going to go into this dark brown shade right here using the same brush that angled one and placing that brown exactly where we just placed that light neutral shade and again going back in with that fluffy tapered blending brush but anyways how are you doing how is everyone legit the love that i'm getting from y'all and um, still due to the lashes is fucking insane generally i can't get over it Y'all make my damn day, every damn day. So thank y'all so, so, so much. I feel hella blessed. But your girl could possibly be coming out with more products. Well, not myself. 
bit more collabs. Oh, legit, I haven't stopped smiling for the past like fucking two months. No joke, getting all this organized and ready. Down there, I cannot fucking wait. And I hope y'all enjoy it too. Okay, now she's looking nice and blended. We're gonna go straight into. I just, I can't say this word. I look dumb as fuck. Noir, noir. It's a black. It, it's a fucking black. I'm gonna use again that angled brush, wiping off any excess onto my damn trousers. <laughs> and we're gonna go straight into that black. Oh fuck, she's picking. Oh bitch. Okay. And I'm gonna place this all over. Oh okay, okay. Place this all over my lids. Yo, this is nice. Normally, even with a black and white, the black always turns out like grey. But this is legit pure black. You know I like to smoke it right up. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. You know I never go for a like, pure black smoky eye, but I'm glad I did because I'm loving this. Okay, I know what we're going to do. We're going to grab the Anastasia Glitzers. I got my big fuck off case right here full of glitter. Okay, so we're actually going to go in with Anastasia Glitter in Mystic Teal. It's this beautiful, fine glitter that is so gorgeous. have not tried this yet, but I used their other um, loose glitter called Star and I, I was obsessed. So we're going to go straight in with her today. And I'm going to use my Body M Glitter Fixer Gel to apply that. Ooh, fuck, she looked like Christmas up in here. Okay, okay. Christmas came early today. We're gonna put that glitter fixer gel right in. I wouldn't recommend applying this straight onto your eye. I would recommend getting a brush or something, but um, I'm lazy as hell and I just wanna put it straight on my back. My, my, my. And then we're gonna just pop some of that glitter fixer gel right onto the brush, just so the glitter attaches. And then, oh wow. Ooh, okay. How beautiful though, oh my days. And now we're gonna pop on some lashes. I'm gonna go in with some Lily lashes. And this is in the style Caramel. Gorgeous, wispy, found right out. Just my style of lash. I'm gonna get my tweezers, cause you know I can't do shit with these fucking acrylics on. Happy days. Let's stick this baby on. You know what I like to normally do is apply the lash glue onto the lid whilst wet and then take her back off to air dry. So, oh, I love these. Fuck. Fuck me up, Lily Lash. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm gonna quickly go and do the other eye off camera and get back to y'all and we can continue on the face. Fuck. Okay. Y'all probably can't even hear the music I'm listening to. Which looks fucking awful because I'm just going to dance into fucking the sound of me breathing. Okay, both as nice and done. We're looking to you or whatever. Now we're going to move on to the face. Yes, honey. Now I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Golden Beige. You know what's good. And as always, I'm going to just splatter that lotion all over my face. Now I'm going to zoom y'all out. There we go, I've zoomed y'all out a little bit just so we ain't too close up in the face still. Don't want to traumatize y'all. I'm going to go in with my Unicorn Cosmetics. I just think this is almost like a Kabuki brush for your, for your, for your foundation. So we're going to go straight in with her and blend this all out. See, look, I'm holding my head again. Literally, I didn't even mean to do that. I just always hold my head. Like, bitch, I ain't going anywhere. What the fuck are you doing? Now, foundation is nice and blended. We're going to go straight into concealer. And I'm going to use a mixture today. I'm going to use Doll 10 Concealer in the shade Light Slash Medium. And I'm going to use... Where is she? My Body M All Night Concealer in the shade 03 Cookie. Now we're going to apply the Body M Concealer, exactly the same but more down, almost like that triangle kind of shape. I'm going to do my um, nose bridge, the tip of my nose, my cupid's bow and my chin. And now we get to blending.
Okay, now we're nice and blended. And we're gonna go in with my Vichy Loose Powder. You know I'm obsessed with this shit. And then we're gonna use my Maybelline Fit Me Powder for all over the face. But yeah, I've literally got so many ideas coming for the next few videos. Um, I did mention on my Instagram about doing a three-part series with my tattoos. I know Jeffrey um, starred on that already. Um, also, I won't keep it, like, I won't make it the same as his, like, the name and stuff like that. But literally, I get asked every single day about my tattoos. Um, so I think doing, like, a three-part will, like, explain everything and, like, explain in depth of which one and why I went for this one and, you know, all that. I'm gonna be real cheesy. Comment down below if you want to see that. But now we're all powdered. We're gonna go straight into chiseling out those cheeks. And we're gonna go in with my Tark. Tark. I swear I can't speak. My Park of Prance. My Park of Prance. Fuck me until I get together. Park of Princess. Tart. Chisel palette. And I'm gonna go into the shade Princess Cut. This one right here. I use this as not just a contour but a bronzer as well. Just when it's more softer because I've already got like pretty sunken in cheeks as it is, so I don't want to make that like hell intense um, for today's look. So now we're gonna go onto highlight and we're gonna use a newbie. I ain't gonna tell you the name or what it's called because she ain't out yet. Stay tuned and just empty some of her out into the lid. Since this is a loose powder, obviously, I'm gonna control myself a little bit. Ooh! Stop! You fucking kidding me? <coughs> I just inhaled some of it as well. Legit, this highlighter makes my skin look wet. Can't, oh my god, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't get enough. So now we're literally glistening to fill. We're gonna go in back to the eyes and smoke out that lower lash line. We're gonna go back in with that dark brown shade and smoke that quite close to the lash line. Like so, and then we're gonna go into that black shade right there and put that basically right on the lash line not the water not the actual water line but placing it right up to that lash line now eyeshadow done i'm going to add a little bit of black liner into that water line i'm going to go straight in with nyx slide on glide on liner just black and pop that right in that water line now what i'm actually going to do is go back into the palette and use that shade pearl right there it's almost like um it's got like a light rose gold reflex to it and i'm going to use that on another packing brush this is from beauty combines and i'm going to pop a little bit of her on that brow bone okay cute now lippy what are we going to do today oh Okay, so I'm going to go into this liquid lippy from Primark and she is called 02 Pink in Excess. It's almost like this grey purple kind of shift, which I think will look beautiful. So let's put her on. Oh yeah, I genuinely love these lipsticks so much from um, Primark. They're so smooth and just glide on like butter. Oh, love it. Lipstick done, and I'm actually living for this. What do y'all think? Okay, so I legit just forgot I had this wig. Um, I've had this for a few years now. I'll link, um, well not link, sorry. I'll say below where I got it from. Um, but yeah, I think this wig makes this look 110%. I'm so happy that I still have this, yes! Feeling my Kylie Jenner vibes with this wig on. But yes, that is us all done. Look complete. 
I'm actually loving how this turned out. I've been dying to try this green glitter since I've gotten it and it worked like a gem. The eyeshadow blended out like an absolute dream. Um, you know I would tell you everything, the truth, but for real, absolutely love this palette. I know I'm going to use this not on myself but my clients too. And yeah, I'm just so happy with how this turned out. So as always, I hope you have a bomb ass day slash night wherever y'all are. And if you like this, please give this a thumbs up, subscribe, comment, all that shit. You know what to do already. You know what to do. But yeah, thank y'all so damn much for watching. I love y'all. Mwah.